हेलो स्टूडेंट्स नाउ कम टू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स यूजिंग आइडेंटिटीज इवेलुएट दीज आर द फ्यू ऑप्शन वाई हैव ऑप्टेड हेयर सो आई ऑप्टेड ओनली वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव ऑप्शन रेस्ट यू कैन डू इट बाई योर सेल्फ सो लेट्स डू हाउ यू विल ट्राई टू सॉल्व दिस वन लेट्स डू इट सोल्यूशन थर्ड इट इज वन हंड्रेड एंड टू स्क्वायर इट कैन बी सी आई वॉन्ट टू शो यू समथिंग हेयर This will be very easy. This will be hundred plus two whole square. See, so a plus b whole square means a square. We will use this identity. Let me write. We will use this identity. A plus b whole square equal to a square plus twice a b plus b square. This form we will use it. So it will be hundred square. Plus twice hundred into two plus two square is one double zero double zero plus two to the four four hundred plus two to the four so four four zero four four zero four four zero four zero one zero one this is the answer of question number third one now come to this four one. Nine nine eight square. Now, if I try to solve this one like this, nine hundred plus ninety eight. Squaring of nine hundred will be easy, but squaring of nine eighty eight ninety eight will be little bit complicated. So instead of adding, we will go for C. One two three means one thousand minus two. So one thousand minus two gives you how much? Nine hundred and ninety-eight. Now a minus b, we will use this identity. A minus b whole square equal to a square minus twice a b plus b square. So it will look like this: a square minus twice a b plus b square. So it will be six zero. After all, we are squaring. So the four means minus four thousand plus to the four. So one zero 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 four minus four thousand. See, let me solve it here. Let me solve here. Four thousand. Four thousand. Four will come zero zero. This is you ten plus six. Then nine nine. So answer will be nine nine six zero zero four. So let me wrap these two part. So after subtracting four thousand from this value, we will get nine nine six zero zero four. One two three four five six. Here one two three four five six seven is. So this is our answer. Now. Come to the next part. <coughs> this one, five point two. Let me rub this one. In five point uh, five, in five point two, five point two square. We can write five point zero plus zero point two whole square. So a plus b whole square form. Okay, a plus b whole square form means a square plus twice a b plus b square. So it will look like this. Five means five point zero means five. Five whole square plus twice five into zero point two plus zero point two whole square. It will be five five twenty five five to the ten plus two plus zero point zero four. Squaring two to the four, and two times you know two digit will be there after decimal, so you know two digits after decimal. Now twenty seven, it will be twenty seven point zero four. Okay, this is the answer of fifth one. Now we will solve this option. <coughs> Six one, two ninety seven into three hundred and three. See. It will like this, you know. It will look like this. Three uh, hundred minus three into three hundred plus three. So we are using this identity. 
a minus b into a plus b is equal to how much? a square minus b square. It means 300 square minus 3 square. 3 is a 9, 4 0 minus 9. So this 9 means 1, then 9, 9, 9, 8. So this is the answer of 297 into 303. Now come to the last option. Let me rub this too. <coughs> last option. This is 1.05 into 9.5. In this case, 1.05 is 1.00. Plus 0 0.05 okay into but in this case 9.5 it looks like 9 plus 0 0.5 but it's not you know we can't have any similarities here means the first term and the second term doesn't match with the expression of uh, second expression with the first term and second term. So what? See, 9.5, it may be look like 0 0.95 into 10. And 0 0.95, we can write 1.00 minus 0 0.05. Now see here, 1.00, here also 1.00 plus 0 0.05 gives you this value. And minus 0 .0, 0 0.05 gives you 0.95. Additionally, we will have 10. So, in this case, we can write this one like this. Na? See? We can like this one. Right. Uh, we can write, uh, write this one. 0 0.95 into 10. Means 9.5. We can express in this form. 0 0.95 into 10. Now, 1.00 plus 0 0.05 into this one this part we can write 1.00 minus 0 0.05 then into 10 here a plus b a minus b means 1.00 square minus 0 0.05 square okay and this part will be into 10 so let me cover this inside the bracket so, if we square element, it will be 1 minus 25. So, I will write 25. But 4 digits will be there. 2 zeros. 2 digits is there after decimal. The 4. 2500. 0. 0. In this way. Into 10. So, if I subtract this one. Suppose 1 point. How many zeros? Four zeros when zero zero two five ten ten minus five five nine minus two seven then nine nine point zero so it will be zero point nine nine seven five into ten ultimately nine point nine seven five this is our answer so I hope you have understood this part it's at the first point it looks a little bit critical complicated you know but as because we have to make it a plus b into a minus b form so we have changed this one 9.5 into 0 0.95 into 10 so ultimately point, point 0.95 can be expressed like 1.00 minus 0 0.05 just like this one in this way a is a plus b into a minus b in this form and ultimately we got 9.975 so i hope you have understood all the examples right now